Hi right, guys, welcome to another Pathways Wrap, another big week gone as always. Uh, we started our games off with uh, the curtain raiser for our Harvey Norman women uh, up against the Cronulla Sharks at Central Coast Stadium on Friday night. Uh, looked really, really tough defeat there. The girls stuck in it as long as they could, but at the end of the day, just the fitness and the experience of the Sharks team come to the floor, uh, and they got away with that one. Full credit to them. The ladies will look to rebuild again this week, looking for their first win of the season. We then followed that up on Saturday uh, with our flag and our KOE New South Wales Cup, uh, both here at Ironmark uh, High Performance Centre on the Saturday. Uh, a flag up against the Manly Seagulls. A uh, really, really tough uh, game back and forth there, with the final score ended up 20 to 12 in the Seagulls' favour. Uh, again, really great effort from the flag guys, and I'm sure that uh, that win's going to come soon. It's starting to turn. And then with our KOE New South Wales Cup, they made it three straight on the go, uh, really turning a corner with their season at the moment with another great win, uh, getting over the Blacktown workers uh, in that match, 28-16. to Our feature for this week looks at our junior reps presentation evening that we had last week. Uh, we had big seasons in all those comps with our Tasha Gale, our Harold Matz and our SG Ball all looking at how those seasons went and making sure we celebrated the players that had great seasons. Let's look at the trophy winners from those nights and all the uh, things that went on. Uh, on behalf of South City Rugby League Club, I want to welcome you to the presentation evening. Uh, it's a very proud evening for the club and for the juniors. Um, so I'm very grateful to be asked to be able to do the welcome. Uh, I won't speak for too long, I just wanted to um, lay down some thank yous if that's okay. We really understand that at the club uh, we benefit from all the hours that you put in um, to making sure that um, your children um, develop a passion for rugby league, um, they get more skills and they become better players and then they come to us as part of this representative program and that wouldn't happen with all the sacrifices, uh, it wouldn't happen without all of those sacrifices you make. So on behalf of the club I want to thank you for all of that enormous hard work and commitment you give to your kids to make sure that they get to this level. Yeah, I just want to congratulate everybody. Uh, thank the staff again and everybody else's thank you. About uh, it's a thankless job sometimes, especially coaching. Um, but, you know, for these guys to see how respectful they are, not only of uh, the peers, but of you guys, is a credit to the way you've coached, the way you've led these young, young men and women. Um, congr congratulations to Natasha Gale. Uh, it's pretty special to be a part of something for the first time, and it's something no one can take away from you. Um, it'll be in the history books, and you should be proud of yourselves for that. The season you've had, um, and being part of helping the club grow is something that we all value and feel is important. Um, congratulations to um, some of those the young boys. It's good to see Leon um, and Terrell here tonight. Uh, I didn't tell them to come, so um, it's good to see that they, they value uh, the pathway as much as uh, they do at the top. Um, it's a good indication of uh, the respect that the players have across the board. Um, congratulations to Joe. Um, got a lot of raps tonight. But uh, I have to give him another one. Um, I spoke to Brock a few years ago and said that we wanted to build a Pathways program and um, the first bloke that came to mind was, was Joe because he first and foremost cares about the program and, and developing young people but uh, he's also fantastic at his job and uh, he certainly made my life a lot easier. Uh, that's with all the emails. Um, but yeah, I appreciate what you do and I know everybody else in the room does as well. So thanks everyone. Thank you. Great to look back at that evening and thanks to everyone that was involved from both the Rabbitohs and also the juniors uh, to make that night a really memorable one for all the young men and women involved. Looking ahead to games this weekend, uh, it's all happening on Saturday uh, with three grades at home at Ironmark High Performance Centre up against the Knights uh, with our Harvey Norman women starting the day into our flag and then our KOE New South Wales Cup. We would love to see as many uh, fans as we could get here and try and get some uh, W's on the board for those teams. As always, please check the website for details uh, for kickoff times.